Yesterday, while we were moving, we got a call that Clayton's grandma passed away, and it was pretty shocking and unexpected, so we were all really sad. She was an amazing woman. Anybody who knew her knew how amazing she was, so his family and we were all pretty upset. Anyway, so today we are back at the other house, and we are going to be moving some more things to storage, and um, we just helped some family move, and um, we're just back at it. just asked for a lot of prayer for Clayton's family and for Clayton it's just really hard to see him so upset and um, not really know what to do. So I'm gonna have these two pictures. This is my friend Drew who passed away and that's Clayton's great great grandma and then we'll have one of Grand Barb and one of Grandpa Pete. Here's a little collage there. Grand Barb is uh, right there and then we have her here at my wedding with Clayton and John and this was at this Christmas. Yeah, I'm glad um, this Christmas, um, we never get pictures. It's Grand Barb, that's Anita, whoops, and then um, me and then my sister-in-law, we're all Campbell's. She was just an amazing lady, wonderful, caring, giving, went to everything, just all around um, amazing woman. She went into the hospital about two days ago, or three days ago, for an infection, and um, it was she was fine, and then all of a sudden her heart stopped. It was a shock because she had been doing just fine. And, you know, I went from, you know, she's doing great, going to come home. There she is right there at Bella's dock. I honestly have the most amazing in-laws. That's my mother-in-law, Anita, and that's my father-in-law, John. People always gripe about their in-laws, but mine are amazing. I just don't want her to be gone. I just, I was super angry, and obviously I cried, but I just, I just didn't want her to be gone.